What's going on guys, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to add pictures to your videos in Adobe Premiere Pro, so stay tuned. It's been a cold winter and it's lasted far too long. Yo, what's going on guys? I'm Jay Carter Ray from GrowOnYouTube.com teaching you how to be better. And adding pictures to your videos is just as simple as adding a video over your videos. So, first of all, let's delete this adjustment layer so we've got space on our timeline. And let's import our image. Now, I did just download a picture of Rick Grimes from The Walking Dead. So, that is what we're going to use. And we're going to bring that into our pr project. You just want to drag it into your project file area. You could also drag it onto your timeline. But now we're going to drag it onto the timeline from our project area. And as you can see, we have Rick Grimes over our footage. Now let's move this about, move it in the top left hand corner. There we go. We got Rick Grimes being our buddy, helping us out for this video. Now, in order to get rid of the background, you'd have to actually have an image that's already rendered or you'd have to deal with that in Photoshop. If you want me to show you guys how to do that, then leave a comment down below. But as you can see, we've got a picture. Oh, let's turn that off. We've got a picture over our footage and you can move this picture around. We can set a keyframe at the beginning and then move Rick to maybe our shoulder. We could also use the selection tool to do that I believe actually we need to bring this on top of all of our footage in order to use the selection tool I believe let's try that out create a whole new track for him and now can we move him yes and now we've actually just created a motion oh I don't want him there I want him there we created a motion for him to move in this time span. So as you can see, if we play through, he's slowly, slowly gonna inch towards my shoulder. He's sneaking up on me. He's sneaking up on me, the sneaky guy. But eventually we should have probably moved this keyframe a little bit quicker. You can see him get on my shoulder. Now you can just do that by editing the values over there also. But that is how you move photos around, animate photos, you know, they'll do that sort of stuff. So I hope this video helps you out. Be sure to leave a comment down below. Let me know what other tutorials you'd like to see me make. And I'll see you guys in the next Adobe Premiere Pro tutorial. If you want to upgrade your editing and help out the channel, then go to growonyoutube.com forward slash red giant now. Red Giant make a bunch of plugins that make complicated editing techniques easier. The titles and transitions that you've just seen were created using Red Giant Universe. Red Giant plugins like Universe and the Magic Bullet Color Suite help me save time and allow me to create professional looking content for you guys. The best thing is that you can try their plugins out for free. So go to growonyoutube.com forward slash Red Giant to try those plugins out for free now. If you decide that you like their plugins after trying them out for a bit, you can use the code JCARTARAY for 10 percent off your purchase get your free trial of any of these awesome plugins now and make your editing life easier at growonyoutube.com forward slash red giant before you guys go i just want to let you know that you can download your free seo for noobs checklist down below in the description so be sure to get that this checklist will help you get more views and subscribers by making sure that with every video you put up you're optimizing that video and you're giving it the best chance to rank in search so definitely download that it should help you guys out a ton and i'll see you guys in the next youtube guide remember to be better it's been a cold winter and it's lasted far too long so all this warmth i share with you